Hi guys, today I want to show you how to make this concrete rhino using a few simple and cheap materials. First of all, you'll need a printout of the file that you can download from my website using the link in the description. The file must be printed on A1 plain paper. You'll also need cardboard. I took 2.5 mm cardboard. It is thick enough and I can cut it with a box knife. Also, you'll need a scotch tape, white glue or any other paper glue, box knife with some spare blades, scissors and fine cement of course. You need to be very careful with the box knife, especially with thick cardboard. Start with roughly cutting out the shapes. Place the shapes on the cardboard so that they fit. Outline the shapes on cardboard. Cover the outlined shapes with white glue. Glue paper to the cardboard. After glue dries, roughly cut out the shapes from the cardboard. Cover the inner surfaces with tape. I went over the tape with a scraper for better contact. Cut out all the shapes along the thick lines. On the thin lines we make cuts two-thirds deep of the thickness of the cardboard. Cut out the piece of cardboard along the dotted lines in accordance with the distance between the dotted lines. The depth is also two-thirds of the thickness of the cardboard. Cut the edges with dotted lines on an angle. Bend all the cuts, align the edges with the same numbers and attach them with the tape. Make sure that there are no holes in the shell.
Connect to halves in the same way with tape. Reinforce all the edges with tape. Touch the base.
Install the supports and their connectors. The shell is ready, let's proceed with concrete. I am making a very simple mixture, water and cement only. Pour 5 cups of water into a bucket and add 8 cups of cement. We are looking for pancake batter consistency. Put the shell where concrete drops will be easy to wash off because it will get messy. Also keep in mind that there is a chance that concrete will leak, so I recommend to work in the bathroom or outdoors. Pour mixture into the shell. Repeat until the shell is full. Leave a little extra concrete on top at the end. By tapping it, you'll remove internal air bubbles. Correct concrete in an hour and a half. Time depends on the temperature, the warmer, the faster the concrete sets. A couple hours later, correct again and create the final surface. You can disassemble the shell 8 to 12 hours later, it also depends on the temperature. You can correct the defects while the concrete is not fully set yet. My wonderful Rhino is ready. I hope everything worked out. Share photos of your Rhinos on Instagram and make sure to tag me. Share this video with your friends and don't forget to like it and subscribe to my channel if you are not a subscriber already. Have fun and see you in the next video!